Hey everyone, welcome back to another tutorial for mapping in Arctic Survival Ascended. This tutorial is going to be on dino spawns. So first we want to go to the Place Actors panel, search NPC. You'll see NPC Zone Manager, NPC Zone Spawn Volume, and NPC Zone Volume. You want to drag all of these out. And then you're going to take the, what's it called, the Zone Manager, take its location, and then paste its location into the two volumes then you're gonna bring these up you're gonna scale the spawn volume to about 50 for this right now you can change it to any scale you want but the npc zone volume has to be bigger so i'm gonna set this to 60 no that's too much 55 so now it's like this you want it to be like that so now I'm going to take these, move them to gameplay, and now I'm going to create a folder, and I'll call it Dino Spawns. So with that, I will add another section. I'll call this Jungle for the Jungle Biome. I'll then change this to, I'll then create another folder for Jungle for the specific Dino Spawn that goes into this biome. And then... I'm also going to create another one, call it Ocean, and then I'm going to look for the other one afterwards. So right now I'm going to take this NPC Zone Volume, I'm going to click plus here and plus there, and now they're going to be like this. I'm going to do this and assign them. That's how you do it, and then you want the default zone spawn volume floor tags you'll put that there type spawn and that's that you'll then check never spawn in water you'll then change the min desired number of npcs to about 20 for this right now you'll change it depending on your map and the size of the spawn volume because you're going to have multiple per map I'm just doing one on this, well, two on this map, to just show how to do it. So now what you want to do is NPC Spawn Entries Container Object. These are all the spawn entries you can use. Only use ones that are part of the game. So you'll click one, and then you'll check with the same way I showed in the Meshes tutorial by checking Reference Viewer. So I'll go choose the jungle one there. I'll take this, right click, reference viewer. This one's in all of the maps already. Well, not all, but it's in the island. I know that, in Sample Island and Center, so I'll use that. And that's the jungle spawns. I'm now going to select all these. I'm going to lower this so that it goes to the ground. And now it's registered there. I'm now going to create another one. By holding Alt and moving it, I'm going to move this one down. It will be down here. This is going to be the ocean spawn, which I'm going to put here. I'm now going to search ocean. And ocean's right there, so I'm going to use that one. And I know that one has stuff working in the dev kit because I use that all the time, and it works in-game. I'll now use this, put that in there. Now that that's like that, I'm going to uncheck Never Spawn in Water and check Only Spawn in Water for the Water Spawns, just like that. Those are two Dino Spawn Volumes. Now you want to check World Settings. You're going to make sure that Editor Enable NPC Spawners is checked, and Editor Do Force Disable NPC Spawners is unchecked. Now that means your Dino Spawns will work, but first... You're going to go open these. You're going to put these volumes into the Dino Spawns data layer. I forgot to do that earlier, so I'm going to do that now. So now I'm going to find the one for the tutorial map. And here it is. Now I do that, and that's it for the Dino Spawns right now. So now if I do this and test it should work where if i press play 
and load in, there will be dinos on the map right now, so it's about to load right now, I think. Let's see, there. So now, there will be some dinos on the map. Like that. It's already waiting for skinned assets and stuff, which means that dinos are on the map. As you can see, it's like that. The dev kit always runs terribly with dino spawns, but it's fine in game. You'll hear dinos from across the map, even if they're not right beside you. That's normal for the dev kit, but in game, that's normal, and it will work as it's intended to. So yeah, there's dino spawns there. Do that. I can check over here. There will be an ocean spawn somewhere here. Don't know where it is, though. I'll disable fog right now to see. They haven't spawned in yet, but they will spawn in. Unless I'm in the wrong location. There, let's see. Yeah, they're just taking their time to spawn in. But yeah, that's it. And that's how it's done. So yeah, that's it for this tutorial, and I'll see you in the next tutorial on whatever I do it on. Probably player spawns. Yeah. Bye. See you in the next tutorial.